Welcome back to Let's Play Mother Cognitive Dissonance. In the last episode, we completed Chapter 1 and we've moved on to LaRice, the Starman character. Shut down. Huh. We don't have any weapons. Basic Starman bodies model of malleable metal. We have some... Well, we don't even start at full HP or PP. Uh, luckily, we have do have PSI Magnet Alpha. Defective storage unit. What's defective about us? Here we go. Oh, that's convenient. It's working fine right now. Again, weapon system is initialized. Oh, did I get? Oh. Backstabber. Starman confronted you. That's why we were put away. Because we are one shotting each the other star men. Barracks four. Hey, a golden star man. Dug around in the trash can. Super oil can was inside. Heals 35% of Starman's PP. Best used before 20x team. Oh, we kept our records. Super in front of you. He's using his beam attack. Let's see, I think that counts as a physical, so shield should work. to be or if it was willing. It's been a while since I've even seen the story of Rebound. Yeah, arcade game. 
What's up, guys? It's a gem thieves machine. Nobody's beaten Larissa's high score yet. Save point. Larissa, why don't you transfer for deactivation? Giku has gone even crazier than the Earth mission. If you're going to try to escape, you better avoid those guys in the other barracks. Okay, what's Starman Super up there have to say? Are they another one? HP and 50 PSI. Wow. That has to be an ultra rare draw. A 1 in 256. I'm not gonna come after you. To tell the truth, I'd defect too if not for the fact that nobody escapes. I think losing on Earth might have messed with Gigue's head. You can use the hyperpod over there if you want to. But there's a heal point just down there. Engine for a star man. Oh, and it increases speed as well. Oh, that's cool. So just warps away. Okay. Hold it. Your emblem has been torn off. Therefore, you are clearly scheduled for termination. Everybody's a critic. Before any shields go up. There's only one left now. And he's magnetic. God, this is just going to be a back. I'm going to take a single swing. swing. So that's 28 damage. Magnet. See, I like this because it's a different gameplay dynamic. You have to balance doing damage and um, absorbing PSI back. Your teleport skills improved, soldier. Remember that one usage phases you about three tiles. No, wait, I mean paces. But you also need one to disengage. Don't worry about flying into an abyss or wall. Your computer will compensate for obstacles automatically. Also, worrying is optional. Okay. Uh, oh, this is gonna be so disappointing. Sleep mode disc. Download sleep mode with Starman's memory. Is that an ability? Restores about 100 HP to yourself by resting the tooth. Okay. So it's a good out of battle heal. I'm already liking that. Wow. One level up and I'm, t I'm still winning the single encounters. say I'm already really digging this chapter. <laughs> okay. 
okay. Yeah. No, no. This is... Nano machine, son. Uh, do I want to trade this? Yeah, I'll trade it in for the ability to get both morph steel pieces of armor. The abrupt change in music was not expected at all. <clears throat> uh, and I can't afford anything else here. Spread beam might be nice. Oh well. to not have a single vocal party member though. Yeah, let's magnet again. Is he just out of PSI? That might be the case.
guess I would fire Alpha. Nice. Uh, wait, the Mook is an enemy? is a guy. Good to know. I thought that would be a bit more limited. Just a way to plot. Your attention, please. This is your new commander speaking. Geekaway has evacuated his post. Would Mr. Larice please proceed to the experimental tech room and receive his reserved upgrade? And would any Starman designated the ranks of final deluxe or the special ops ghost units please proceed to the bridge for briefing? Thank you, Captain Newey, signing off. scheduled for an raid. I thought it was supposed to be scrapped. Oh, is this a mutiny? Why wasn't I invited? I love mutiny. Alright, level 9. Real. It is. Can I... Okay, I still have to fight supers. I think it's more... I'm not sure if it's a specific level, or if it's a... It simulates, okay, can you take it out in one turn? No, then you fight it. I mean, I doubt that they could have done that on the Super NES, given that they were restricted to 16 megs of memory. disembodied voice. That's strange. 
How can I not go over them? Guess I'll go get that supposed upgrade. Stasis, chemical experiment number 23, all others unoccupied. Order engine and three string. A controversial replacement for beams. Complicated details about the usage of plasma beams versus electricity. Expected the shop theme to play again. You are, it's for the Reese. This box marked with your name on it. Head on upstairs. Orders are orders, even if they're given by a whack job like the way. Got the experimental engine. I can't go through it. This one jumps further. Oh. I... Um... Did I just cause blue screens? I need to stop doing that. <laughs> the keys are probably I have to figure out a way to make sure I land in the right spot. those as much as I should. Like, just to end episodes off. Hmm. I want to check out the east wing here. Restricted area. Please consult the commander for airlock access.
Oh, this is... The robot is working fine. Best not touch it. What's with the music? What? Looks like everyone's here. Do a eyes Larisse oddly. As you know, we've just been hit and wondering by what. It appears we were hit by some sort of shielded organic form. It tore directly from our engine, giving us about 30 minutes to evacuate. As Starman, you should have no trouble in using PSI teleport to the ship, right? We've only got about 10 minutes now that I'm done talking, of course. <laughs> so let's get moving, Sanders. Too low a ranking to report, I see. Well, looks like we're gonna die here. And we still need to Come on, we'll get you out of here, kid. Head to the airlock. New Age joins you. The commander, who is level 75. Holy crap. And she has the inexplicable jolt and incomprehensible zap, too. Shockwave Omega. I'm not sure what the Y is, actually. PK Beam Sigma, PK Beam Beta, Life Up Omega, Healing Omega, Meditate to recover PP instead of Rage. Hero Shirt, Earth Clothing. One stripe adorns the middle. Only someone special can wear it. Prevents insane. Is Neoe supposed to be, like, one of Gygus's Gigoe's people? I'm genuinely not sure here. But I mean, she doesn't seem to be a total jerk. I'm assuming she. I think it said she. Oh, I could have just jumped. Besides Lucas, all pawns and mother are female. Let me go ahead and work on clearing a door to an escape pod. Don't take too long, and watch out for space critters. Oh! Remember when I said that there was one song that tipped me over the edge on playing this? Dr. and Donuts Fringe, more recently known as Megalovania. I didn't expect it to play here, I thought it was the Super Boss theme. It works as a escape theme, I guess. <laughs> I guess I should have had her uh, life up me. I'm gonna be quiet super for this. Starts you here. Now, the fact 
that this particular song is playing may lead people to believe that radiation actually worked on the game. But he actually just allowed them to remix the theme. I think this came after the Homestuck version of it. I don't read Homestuck, I just know it existed there. As it is his signature song, pretty much. Oh, right, the flame door turns all because it mimics PK fire. I might like this usage more than the super boss of Undertale. <laughs> Yes, this is the super boss theme in that game. It's technically. I'm not going into that until I maybe LP that game. Also, wow, this segment. <laughs> Sigma, by the way. Um, comprehensible sap, the alpha. I think the reason I have I'm not doing experts. I think I've said I'm not doing Undertale, but what I really meant was. Sudden shift from Megalovania. <laughs> Good job. So we've made it over to Saturn. Up to you, get the key. Drag that junk all the way to Satan this time. We got a show to put on. They're needing their gear and their meds. Sweet slam jam drummer. I'll be right behind you. Of course, the crud's already down there. Oh, we're switching over to the uh, UFO character, Zarball. Who has sparks. Recharge, Shield Alpha, Ozon just has Life Up Alpha. We have a Beam, Cast Iron UFO Body, and a Plain Coin. Ozon has Blue Laser, a Shine Stone UFO Body. Just heading down to Satane, that shouldn't be too bad. Careful dude, there's all these jerks on our turf now and all the ground done got busted up. Living on the rings ain't easy, but I got your back. I, I don't know why I'm a hippie southerner. Bows on there. <laughs> I really don't know. Oh! Oh, he acts on his own. Okay. But I really could have sworn that Megalovania was the super boss theme. But maybe it's also used as that. Um, let's spark. 
Goodbye, Starman. If you get banged up, I can help a bro out and learn some fancy healing tricks from that blue dude. Just don't ask me while we in a fight. Ain't no time for no mumbo jumbo while we're smacking down some fools. What is his... What is his speech pattern supposed to be? Also, I like how we have a little backpack. It's adorable. <laughs> Just a little UFO with a little backpack. Nothing wrong with that. Just a little UFO, little backpack. Ugh, oh, heck, mooks. Just ignore him, dude. Keep on flying. Nothing Dan and his boys got to say is ever good. Wait. That, that, that's Dan. Yeah, I'm gonna watch the show. Don't want to be questioned, you know? If I go out there now, I might, be, I might see somebody pretty dangerous. Us doesn't really want to talk. We're waiting for things to kick up. Oh, there's a present here now. Life noodles. How that works on a UFO, I don't know, but it doesn't matter because it's death water. You brought along the money? Excellent. <clears throat> oh, no, just the actual B. All right, we're almost ready. Would you be a sport and go set the guitar on the case over by the pillar? Oh, Stolero, she is. Oh, hey, it's... is that Colonel Saturn? Now we're just waiting on the front man. Who is that Harry coming toward us? Why, I never... What a positively terrible team of ridiculous posers you are. You think you're the band? I'm the real underground business here. I can tell you're not them. Well, actually, shut up. You and that fake imitation hat. I bet you're not half the musician that the real Colonel Saturn ever was. As a matter of fact, you deserve a trouncing. Prove you're for real or you don't get to play a note. What? What? The biggest and hairiest fan put up its dukes. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, it actually is Colonel Saturn. Okay. Uh, what does Scan do? Is that just Libra? He's so underground, he's never even heard of himself. Never mind anyone else. The hat is a knockoff replica of Colonel Saturn's. <laughs> well, the boson did the same thing, apparently. now. But, wow, you've got some skills. At least you'll be a passable cover band. Come on, I'll help you get set up. But, where's... Only Edgar is whack. What? What does that even mean? I think I'm gonna end things off there, so next time on Let's Play Mother Cognitive Dissonance, we're gonna try and find a Linavir. See you guys then!